All right, YouTube, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to remove those black bars from your Oculus Mirror recordings and also how to make the video 1920 by 1080 rather than Oculus's standard. I think it's like 1250 by 700. What you want to do is find your finder window and then you're going to find the drive that your Oculus is saved in. Click on Oculus and go down to support. Click on to support and then you're going to find Oculus Diagnostics. Double click on Oculus Diagnostics. From there you'll see where it says Oculus Mirror. You're going to go ahead and find Oculus Mirror, right click on it, and then go to the bottom and select Create Shortcut. It's going to pop up with a message that says uh, Oculus Mirror cannot be saved here. The, do you want to create the shortcut on your desktop? You're going to go ahead and hit Yes. Since I already have it on my desktop, I'm just going to select No for now. You can go ahead and close your Finder window. And from here you're going to find your Oculus Mirror uh, shortcut. You're going to right click on it. And once you right click on it, you're going to go down and find properties. You're going to click on properties. It's going to open a new window up for you. You can go ahead and find where it says target. And that should say uh, something uh, like C drive, Oculus, Oculus support, diagnostics, wherever your Oculus is stored. Mine's stored on my E drive, so it looks a little different. But um, yeah, it's pretty much going to be the same thing. And then right after where it says oculusmirror.exe, this is the important part. This is where you're going to want to type in exactly what it says right here. So you're going to want to type in dash dash size 1920 by 1080 space dash dash disable FOV stencil space dash dash disable time warp space dash dash right eye only. And I have it right here on the window so you can go ahead and pause this if you'd like and you can copy this down. And then you're going to just want to hit apply once you're done. And that's pretty much it. It's just going to be set from there. You don't have to worry about anything. Um, every time you open up Oculus to go ahead and record, you're just going to want to click on this one, that the shortcut that's on your desktop. So you can go ahead and use this Oculus mirror. You're going to notice the screen's a lot bigger and uh, you're not going to have those black edges anymore. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you a preview of what it used to look like with those edges and how it looks like now with the 1920 with no edges. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos. Peace.